Hello and welcome back to Warper Scavengers, our scaven playthrough of Warhound City of the Damned. Okay, so we have our deadly here. Got everybody available, we are going to launch a mission. Your scouts have discovered a rival warband in the facility. These warriors are clustered around their wagon, making them a very attractive target. Okay, so it looks like we are against chaos. A new round has started. It's going to be fun. Right, so if the Altes, their cart is that way, we're going to head for the building that is right between us and them, or the archway even. Let's ambush with you. So we're just going to be super aggressive and just go for them. See how that works out. Right, let's get Antonor on the move. It's okay, we've seen someone already. Let's overwatch. Get Fernandez de Cordova on the move as well. Up you there. So we've seen two of them so far. Here's the first dude. Ah, uh, six a different dude, okay. Missed him with the ambush. He is going to hit us with his second one though, probably. We hit him with our second one at least. Yep. Hit us, did a fair amount of damage, hit us again. Put us in a bit of trouble. This guy's coming along. Okay, he can get as far as he wanted to get, which is good for us. So 7170 is important to us because it's gonna oh and then that guy as well is not gonna be great okay it's a good start deep throat succeeds he hasn't got the best movement those are the problem for us let's ambush here to do a bit of cover at least okay now why do we need you to be able to make it up there Whitey can make it on here. Okay, we've got to go down to 200. That's not amazing. We need more than that. This guy coming along. Hey, okay. Cesar Borgia. Get you going. Okay, pop you there. This is Vidgun. Oh, nice. Ben the chop nobody else did. Always good. I wish there. Okay, 
Edward, let's get you on the move. Let's go down this way. And wish there. Okay, and then Mordred. Right. Now. Oh, use globe. Make sure we're hitting you. Another one. And then do poison or where can we throw poison to is the thing. Because poison our overwatch is gonna be what we're gonna do. So we need to move over a little bit. No, I still need to move more than that. Do it here. Don't particularly like that. Um, I suppose because some of our guys are going to have to run into it then. We're going gonna, gonna, to um, keep moving up a bit more. I'd rather poison those guys than him, really. Let's place it there because they're all almost certainly going to run through that spot. And we can end your turn. No, poor Whitey. 129. Wow. A new round has started. Okay, now. If Vialti is, is going to be a bit of an anchor here on this side. We load Antonor. Okay. We start with name shot at you. Good hit. We we'll love for one. Next reload is gonna be two, so. Choo choo next. We love for two. And then we're going to overwatch. Okay, good. And that's really good for us because the leader has pretty much isolated himself.
Wait. It's web steel with you. We're hoping he goes for you. And not Whitey. Oh no, Whitey's gone. Okay. And then he comes for you. Right. Yeah, so we overstretched a little bit, but as I said, we we're gonna be very aggressive about things. Normally I wouldn't be anywhere near as aggressive. Okay, got flare for everybody. Running blood, we don't like that. He's damaging everyone, including his own guy. Right, now Deep Throat can come in and get involved with those fights there. Yeah, so generally if I was being cautious, this fight would actually be happening back there, kind of where the wall, if you imagine if you keep extending the wall to the left, kind of around that area, back to the cart. As I said, we're taking a far more aggressive approach on things. Uh, we'll take that. Actually, no. Let's just leave that on Whitey. Because that way then he'll have it when we're done. And now let's start working on you. Oh nice. First crit stun, or crit. Again, it recently been getting a lot of crits without the stun part. A few more stuns. Right, he's very scary, 71. He didn't come. Whitey, unfortunately, doesn't get a turn. Right, yeah. Let's deal with you. Decent smack there, and then a parry. But he's kind of made himself a bit of a target for us as well. And he's going to do something similar, yeah. Put the parry there. They hit back. Another good parry. We won't get the hit back this time. Okay, Vidkun. It makes sense to put you here and to focus on killing the leader first. Because then we release, if we do this, we release you and, and the guy beside you, then move on to the next fight. Rather than having that guy over there who is fairly fresh, soaking up damage. So Edward here kills their leader. Okay, he's one of the people that we need to kill, so we'll take all of that. Objective completed. Objectives updated. Then you're gonna go around here. So you could have gone all the way around on the other side. So fine. And then we start on this guy. And you take your sidestep. Now Mordred. 
Can you get into this fight? Can. Good. So we may have lost Whitey, but right now I don't feel like there's any fight where we're at a disadvantage. Obviously, that fight there with those two um, could go very wrong for us. But I don't feel we're at a disadvantage with it. And we're pretty much negating their ranged because we're not getting close enough for them to actually start shooting us. Okay, so let's start with Infuse Globe. And try to only hit our guys. Like so. Good. Then we're going to go with Poison Globe. Um, those two. And then we're going to overwatch because we do have that guy that is at 71 who we're fairly worried about. Okay, so FBLTs won't like that he's targeting them, especially not that much damage. And then, But split their damage between the two. So that's going to be a big problem for started. you. Because we're going to focus our damage on you. Which means you're probably going to die this round. And then we can kind of flood onto this guy here. It's kind of, that's the way I kind of look, look at these kind of fights is it's almost like a river, like a river of rats where what we're actually doing is we are you know flowing in and taking care of like inundating what's in front of us and then once we've gotten rid of that then we move on to the next part and it very quickly builds to the point where we are very much in the ascendancy Here's a good shot we love one and next reload is going to be two. Let's not aim. Let's try shoot you again. Missed. Okay. Now we reload two, and we're keeping two builds. We're keeping at least one to be able to get back here, and then Overwatch, because we don't want don't want Anthar getting caught on the wrong side of those fights. Now. Commander's deck it over, good hit there, nice crit, and then you can wipe steel. Bale's not alone, so we, he'll take damage, and then he'll run through the poison as well. So we'll take additional damage from that, and the poison should proc next turn. Actually. There's no poison in there. Yeah, because the poison poison's actually over there. So that's kind of a graphical error that's shown poison there. Yeah, so we that's why it didn't take damage, because that's not actually poison. Just the game being a bit derpy. As it's want to be. Okay, now. We are gonna take poison ourselves. Let's loot you. But you're not one of the people we want to kill. Okay. Let's move on to you. You are one of the people we want to kill. Right, let's sidestep with you. Now, we may be a little bit vulnerable now because this guy coming up. I'm expecting him to turn up right here.
But if he doesn't, we'll be fine with that. Okay, he did. Good. Yeah. Let's get working on this guy. So already at this point, it's going to be really hard for them to turn this fight around. Now, it's not possible to be able to do because what basically what they need is, first of all, consolidate all the people and get them here. And then start focusing on our weakest people. And then just, you know, subtly change the, change the dynamic where instead of us doing things like this, where we're picking on, you know, one person with two, even it up, start picking on our weaker people with two people, and then they'll get this, they would get the same kind of benefit that we get. As in, they could start flooding people on to to other fights if they can get the more vulnerable people down. But I don't expect them to do that. But what can happen is that if we have things like that where we're not hitting, it may just naturally happen over time anyway. So we need to, yeah, we need good hits like that to avoid that kind of situation. There we go. And you can see like his, his, not just his um, hit point pool, but also his kind of resistance to taking a lot of damage is why we didn't move someone over there in the first place. Okay, now we're going to, hang on. Hang on, I need to put a cut in here. Okay, apologies, I have to put a quick cut in there. Just chat with someone a second. Now, um, we're going to just put you in a stance for now. Because I'm waiting for that guy to come back. Now, he's so close to being able to shoot us that if he just gave up that high position and come down, he could really start contributing. Now this guy will, oh, apparently not. <laughs> See, he will be able to contribute, but not yet, apparently. Right. 64, shoot you. Miss, okay. Let's get that reload on. And one of you is globe. For everyone there. Good. Then we get our watch ready. So wherever the leader shows up, he's almost certainly going to be taking damage really quickly. Okay, web steel. This person is fine. Reload. You can aim this one now. Good hit. I'd say. Given the rate that we're we're hitting the guy, it's probably probably going to be that he has a little bit of health left at the end of this round, and then we'll finish him off next round. So then those three guys will be will be available then to move on somewhere else. Did that again there. So this I I think I mistakenly call him the the leader. He's not. I guess he's now the de facto leader though, seeing as their leader went down. What's the guy that we killed Barra though? I have a feeling the 71 is probably Barra. No rhyme or reason to that, but I just feel like it. He throats. A bit of poison going there. Oh, that's good though. That's this guy done then. 
guaranteed kill. Beautiful. Now we need to get. We were already um, poisoned, so completed. we can do that with you. Objectives updated. And then let's get your side step on. Mr. Borgia. Right, we took his dodge. And we hit him as well, that's good. Right, you whip steel on. It's the back dude now. Yeah. He should just move forward and start shooting us. He's trying to get up there, get height. There he goes, okay. Now that's decent. They should really move their other guy over there as well. But the problem they're really going to have is that it's a bit late for doing stuff like that. Like they need pretty much coordination in their efforts and there's none really happening. Oh, we left him with four health. Okay, sidestep. Okay, so someone's gonna have to eat his own watch when we flit around the corner. Or did those gonna go through here? And maybe the one that has to eat that old watch. Yep. Okay. Now we're looking for this guy that was in here. Now did he go? He may have just gone all the way up these stairs. He didn't. Okay. So let's come back down then. Be careful because we can't reclaim pills. We spent so the other place he might be is in here. Don't see him in here either though. Oh hi there. Um don't really need to check what's in there, but I'm going to anyway. Blue form, okay. Purple shield as well, but we don't really care about that. Check. Here. Oh, found you. Hello there. It's... You're Carson, so you're not one of the people we need to kill. But you're dead anyway. So enjoy, I guess. The ambush with you. Now, Benedict, come on over here and check if this was the last guy we need to kill. It wasn't. Endre. Okay. So, oh, there's Barra. Well, Barra, let's see just how good you are at shooting. You're going to be in there with a shoot off now. Although, honestly, I think they're going to they're going to fail the reg test before he dies. Reload in the turn. A new round has started. Okay, if the old days over here first. Let's go all the way. Around. Okay, well let's kill this guy to start. Good. 
and I want you to come. Yep, absolutely meant to do that. Of course I did. Yeah, let's charge you. In that turn. The answer, come on up here. Shoot Barra. Or at Barra. Let's aim this one. Then overwatch for that scary dude coming 71. Okay, and this there Nova. I think you've done what we need you to do, so just go back here and dodge there. You throw it, you got a bit more to offer, so let's move over here. Let's hit this guy a few times. Succeeded, okay. And so Mr. Scary, is he gonna turn up or not? He's just like a specter. Right, he didn't turn up so far. Let me see, you can now come over and go on this side. Start flashing here. So he's definitely going to die before Barra does. Especially when Barra's doing stuff like that. It's limited what we, how many shots Antonor can take. Oh yeah, you're definitely going to die first. Edward, you should actually be able to finish him off. Oh, actually, no, because your damage got reduced. You need a crit to kill him. Left him on 4 HP. Seems likely even you on 4 HP. He's going to get to shoot people. Oh, wow. Hold on. Right, Mordred, with a nice little job for you. Let's see if we can get up here. I think you can. Oh, hang on. You're missing a leg, right? Let's see it properly, but Pretty sure he's missing a leg and that's why he can't climb there, right? Yeah. Well, that guy's lucky, I guess. And you can't get involved in that fight. So you're going to come here and risk being attacked by the other dude, I guess.
failed them all alone. I think anyone would fail them all alone in those circumstances. Let's aim. Not bar it. Good hit. Reload. some good hits there. Still not going to kill him first though. This guy's going to die pretty much top of this round. A new round has started. Yep, that's where he dies. Now. Now here. Um, actually, jump back down. And you can party there. Deep throat should be able to get up there. Antonor. Let's aim at Barra. Yes, okay. Reload. Okay, we get the chance Barra can be killed. We need to keep Web of Stealing back here. They succeeded again, okay, so we will get the chance to kill Barra. So it's really only Whitey we're worried about now. Oh, that guy turned up though, like we thought he might. So now we are in a bit of trouble over there. Good miss though. That's the problem, he doesn't miss that often. Right. It's past your stupidity check. Climb up here. Something. It's actually going to be three hits. I was going to say two, two hits might do, but no, three hits are needed. Okay, not anymore. So he dies. Get that. Do the old shuffle with the stuff. Objective completed. Jump down and head over here. Fail a fear test, why not? And hit him anyway. Okay, and the turn. So we're going to try our best to kill that guy. Actually, it's better if you don't get in that fight. Because you've only got one swing. And some like Vidcoon should do more damage as well. Vidcoon, let's bring you around this side. It's a nice hit. So we're definitely not going to kill them unless they pass another check. Which they still can because they still have a hero. It's just going to be a lot harder for them. Yeah, so he 
he die next turn anyway. But I think they're gonna fail here. Yep, there we go. Okay. Well done, guys. Let's just hope that Whitey is okay. And again, look at the terrible stuff we get for the option on a deadly. One purple helmet of memory. And a white hammer, really. Fool things to think one defy mighty warband. All, all die, die. Let leave no survivor me dream. Warband grows strong, great. If listen, follow wise filch. Yeah, whatever, wise filch. Oh God, goodbye, Whitey. <laughs> it's over for this one. Yeah, unlucky. Wow. Okay, light wounds there. Okay, so we actually need another leader. Oh, I need to check. Okay, so yeah, we can get a rank seven guys straight away. Um, so yeah, <laughs> post me a name for our new leader. That's a bit of a shock that, that happened, <laughs> to be honest. Right. So I'm going to sell a bunch of stuff so we can afford get ourselves a new leader. Maybe the fact that we got a white hammer was a an indication that Whitey was going to die. Let's get rid of that and that and that. More expensive stuff. Anything like this that has blue on it, you know, as a purple item, can get rid of. We do have Weeping Blades for the new dude as well. Okay, so Thunderbolts can go. I don't think we're going to give them heavy armor, so that can go as well. Okay, I think we have enough now. So let's hire you. Okay, so straight away I want to get to Agility 15. Then next we'll go into Toughness and Strength after that. Um, I want to give you at least Intelligence 9. Leadership 12, and then everything else goes into Alertness. Okay, Weapon Skill we want 12 to start. Then we'll go for 11 accuracy. Okay, good. Then we have skills, so I'm going to start, confirm that. So we start with side step. Okay. And then we bump that up to do high as we can. Yeah, passives. Passes the next thing we want. Increase melee critical hit by 5% when using daggers or fighting claws. You're not going to do that. Hmm. Commander. Increase no we don't don't do that. Um let's see. We do want to give you intimidate. And again I want to 
Uh, oh, we need 15 leadership for that. Okay. So, yeah, I want to probably work on your leadership to 15 then. Then we want passive. I don't want one that's just going to increase your your dodginess. Avoid, there we go. Let's confirm that and then let's up that again. Okay, good. So you now have 105% dodge, which will obviously be reduced by other people's abilities. Right, so give me a name for for Kalbaz when you get the chance. Now I need to sell some stuff to the pay everyone as well, so let's do that. We're going to actually let's sell both of those. Okay, then that might just be enough, but we can Definitely get rid of some of this sort of stuff as well. Okay. Then back here. We'll pay our treatment. And our upkeep. Now we need to also kick this guy out. Let's see that. So. Holding of nobles, agility, uh, leadership. Yeah, we like those. Then main thing is going to be weeping blades. There you are. And then we're going to give you warp up pistols. Is your backup weapon? We we'll switch that out for magic resistance, or yeah, that one. Okay. Then some enchantments, start up there. What are those ones? Let me check in a second. Focus, leech is we don't care about. True grit, stun resistance. Okay, yeah, we'll put that on there. Weeping blades in. Um, we're going to have to get some money to enchant those, so let's do that. And sell off the stuff. These daggers can definitely go. Mesa Fury, like you. Hunting rifle can go. Regular pistol can go. Let's get to about 500 if we can. Art can go. Focus, like shortbow, antidotes. Okay, we're at 500 already. So, get rid of those swords as well. Okay, I think that's going to be enough for now. Right, let's get back to his equipment. So what is this? Sticky slot, just empty that. And from the shade, empty that. Right. Now, what enchantments do you have for this? Misfortune. Critical resistance, that could be good. That's not bad, but I think that's probably better. Yeah, let's pop that on. Then, chanting you. Oh, 
I want to get one of these other ones on, on them, so we're not going to put any on just yet. Okay. Now, let's find a new deadly if we can. Or normal deadly. There we go. Okay. That's the next one we'll do. Yeah, so that was crazy. Poor old whitey, eh? But what can you do? Right, so that is the end of that one. Hope you've enjoyed. Hope you keep me safe with there. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, maybe consider hitting the subscribe button there on the right or checking out some other videos here on the left. Or perhaps you might even share with some friends.